A white panther is a white specimen of any of several species of larger cat. Panther is used in some parts of North America to mean the cougar, in South America to mean the jaguar and elsewhere it refers to the leopard. A white panther may therefore be a white cougar, a white jaguar or a white leopard. Of these, white leopards appear to be the most common, although still very rare. Melanism White panthers may be the result of albinism, leucism or the chinchilla mutation. Unlike the black panther, white panthers have not been selectively bred. The genus name Panthera is a taxonomic category that contains all the species of a particular group of felids, but as a general term panther is also used for other felids, more commonly for melanistic individuals, but also for white or normally colored individuals. White panther types, white jaguar. The white jaguar is a prime example of the genitus helizius mutation that has been proven to be the largest growing mutation among big cats. This genetic deformity causes the species it has afflicted to become more aggressive than the average big cat. In some cases the panther has been seen grey due to the wetness of its coat. White Leopard, in Harms Worthington Natural History, Richard Lidecker wrote, Far rarer than black leopards are white ones, of which but very few have been met with. As well as white leopards, there are pale cream leopards with pale markings and blue eyes. A white to cream colored leopard with pale spots and blue eyes was shot at Sarsaran in the Maharaja or Dumrains jungle. Similar specimens have been recorded from southern China, from Hazarai Bar in India, and from Zimbabwe. Arai Pocock reported a purely white skin from East Africa. The spots were only visible in reflected light. In the wildlife of India, EPG wrote that in 1947, a letter in the Statesman of Calcutta asked who has ever seen a white leopard? The question was answered a few years later in the field describing a skin obtained from a leopard shot in a princely state near Patna, Bihar, Bezosesh. The coloring was not due to albinism but lacked melanistic characteristics, there being no black markings, and the color being of various shades of orange and cream resembling that of a really good tortoise shell cat. Another very pale colored leopard was reported in the field in 1953 regarding London Zoo's leopard from West Persia exhibited in 1910 or 1911, in distinct, blackish spots in summer. When autumn came its now longer winter coat lost the spots and became so pale as to be difficult to see towards dusk. This indicates a chinchilla mutation instead of albinism. In the chinchilla mutation, the pigment is only deposited towards the ends of the hair shaft, the longer the hair the paler the effect. A wild-caught albino leopard called Jinx was kept at the Central Park Zoo, USA between 1935 to 1960 and had originated from Mozambique. Descriptions suggest the markings were visible in certain light. White leopards were apparently born at Los Angeles Wildlife Way Station. These were eucystic, that is white but with normally colored eyes. They developed spots as they grew older. During the 1960s, one of two cubs born to a pair of normal spotted leopards at Colorado's Cheyenne Mountain Zoological Park was pure white, but apparently turned black by five months old. In May 1978, a pair of white leopard cubs were born to normal leopards at Rome Zoo. Both had to be hand-reared. The male cub was whitish with light gray spots and died shortly afterwards due to internal abnormalities. The female survived and was snow white in color. As she grew older, her coat turned pale gray and the spots became visible. A 1993 issue of the Journal of the Bombay Natural History Society contained an article listing 11 instances of albino, or partial albino, leopards noted between 1905 and 1965. Most are from the Bihar and Madhul Pradesh areas of India. Unlike melanism, Albinism would make a leopard more conspicuous and a less successful predator. Being both unusual and conspicuous, albino leopards would have fallen victim to big game hunters' guns. A white, but apparently not albino, leopard cub born in Africa was sold to a zoo in Japan in the spring of 1999 and is called Nana. Two leopard cubs were born at the Wildlife World Zoo in Arizona. One, Named Assis was believed to be the only white leopard to be born in captivity. Several experts confirmed that she is white skin, though she was also described as having spots. Blood tests on Assis and her parents were planned if she thrived and if her skin remained white. 
Claws and Paws Wild Animal Park, Pennsylvania, USA, also claimed a white leopard. White Cougar A white cougar has been photographed and was not albino but eucystic. There are reports that a white cougar is displayed at the Walter Rothschild Zoological Museum, Tring, England, being the same white cougar that London Zoo bought from the animal dealer Jamrach and which lived at London Zoo from May 1848 until January 1852. In reality, however, as confirmed in December 2011 by cryptozoologists Carl Schuker and Loren Coleman, the specimen in question is not a cougar at all but is instead the above pictured albino leopard, which is clearly labeled as such, and, as revealed by the museum staff, was derived from Asia. Also, its leopard rosettes are readily visible. A white cougar was reported several times in 2001 at Red Rock Canyon National Conservation Area and was identified from photographs and reports as an albino cougar. There is also a calico specimen currently on display as of July 2009 in La Bourbonse Zoo, France. A white puma was born in October 2011 at the Attica Zoological Park in Greece. References Welcome Casper. At Attica Park. Lydecker, R. Johnston, H., and Ainsworth Davis, Jr. Harmsworth Natural History, A Complete Survey of the Animal Kingdom. G. E. P., The Wildlife of India, External Links, December 12, 2011, The White Panther of Tring, Mutant Leopards, Mutant Jaguars and Mutant Pumas, Albino Leopard at Natural History Museum, Tring, England.